Are you tired of this happening while taming Titanoboa? My name's Techorsa, and today I'll show you how to tame a Titanoboa, and if you stick around, I'll tell you a couple of neat things about tame Titanoboa. First off, let's prepare. Titanoboa are strange with the food they like to eat. They will only eat fertilized eggs. The eggs are organized into several groups. Giganotosaur, Bronto, Dimetrodon, Allosaurus, Trike, Baryonyx, Oviraptor, Ankleo, Archaeopteryx. I'll put the full list of eggs broken into these groups on the screen now, and I'll also link to the wiki article in the description. I can find no consistent data on the time to tame for each egg group. However, the lower quality eggs require exponentially more eggs, but about the same amount of time. I would recommend using Diplodocus eggs, since they're easy to tame, or Dimetrodon eggs, since they are more space efficient for mass breeding. Giganotosaur eggs are still going to be the best if you can get your hands on them. Condition the area around the Titanoboa. Kill off any carnivores that could interfere with your taming. You'll need to keep an eye on the one you want to tame while you do this, and if you have tribe mates to help you, they can be defending the area while you start taming. The easiest way to tame a Titanoboa is on the back of a flyer. So make sure you have some form of flyer that can carry the amount of eggs you need. You can also build a trap. While not wholly necessary, it helps keep the Titanoboa you're trying to tame from being distracted. If you do decide to use a trap, you'll need at least a 3x3 wooden foundation with three walls high and a ramp leading up one side of it. Anything smaller than that will allow the Titanoboa to either not fit or escape. Fly low to the ground to get the Titanoboa's attention and lead it into the trap. As a side note, if your server has picking up wild creatures enabled, you can pick up a Titanoboa with an RG and drop it into your box. Just make sure to keep some stems handy. Once it's in the trap, fly straight up into the air to reset its aggression towards you and your structures. Hover over the trap and drop your eggs one at a time as they're being eaten. These eggs need to be dropped from your inventory and not from your mount. If they're dropped from your mount, the Titanoboa will not eat them. Depending on the type of egg you're using, it can take up to 8 minutes between feedings, so you need to be patient at this point. I also need to note here I couldn't find consistent data about the feeding interval. The longest time I found was 8 minutes, and the shortest was about 20 seconds. Continue feeding the Titanoboa eggs until it is tamed. If this video was helpful, make sure you like and share it. Your support really helps out the channel. Now for the neat facts I promised earlier. Titanoboa can be used for their venomous attack. Their only attack deals 3 times the damage dealt in to 4 damage over 10 seconds. After they are tamed, Titanoboa will only eat eggs, fertilized or otherwise. You can also kill wild Titanoboa for Titanoboa Venom, which is used as tribute to summon bosses. That's all I've got for today. Thank you guys so very much for watching, and have yourselves a very good day. Whoa, shit. That scared the crap out of me.